watching my vlog channel thanks for joining thanks for watching all that um while we're here please don't forget to subscribe to my channel um if you like my vlogs if you here for just my daily life my daily living a little bit of entertainment little tips here and there um yeah so hit that subscribe button hit the like button thumbs up all that yeah um y'all don't get tired because I'm tired as fuck. I'm so tired. I'm trying to get my life together. I've been asleep. I don't even really know what time is. What time is it? Seven. Eight o'clock. I've been asleep. For like the last three hours. And I'm supposed to be doing intermittent fasting and not eating past, um, 6.30, I don't think, <laughs> I don't think this gonna work. This time change is just throwing me completely off. It's throwing me all the way off. Time went up on Sunday, and I have not been able to get my life together since. Like, I'm just so tired. Like, for some reason, Monday morning, I woke up at like 3.30 in the morning, and I was just up all day. I couldn't go back to sleep. I got up and immediately was like, I gotta cook. I'm hungry. I don't feel like cooking. And it'll be so much easier to just go get something to eat. But, um, I'm not gonna do that. I am on a challenge for myself not to eat fast food. I don't know how long this challenge is actually. So I downloaded this app. Um, what is the app called? Yazio, Yazio, or something like that. If I can link it, I'll link it uh, below. If I can figure out how to do that, I don't know how to get the links to apps. But anyway, y'all, it's my new favorite app. I love it because I feel like it just it gives things for free that most apps try to charge for. I mean, of course they do have a membership subscription which you get meals and stuff, but. I don't ever join that because I don't be cooking the meals because they don't even be looking good. Um, so I just have the free version of the app, but it does everything I need it to do. Like I log my food for the day. I told it how much I, how much weight I wanted to lose, and it gave me the amount of calories that I need to take or intake per day, which I'm not even really sure if it's right on that or not. Um, because it told me like 1760 calories or something like that a day but every other app that i've ever done always has me at like 1400 calories um to get to where i want to go so i don't know about that but we'll see but it says that i'll be at my goal weight um which i'll lose 140 pounds I think not 140 pounds. Shit, what am I talking about? <laughs> I will lose. <laughs> I will lose 50. I think 52 pounds. I don't know. I'm trying to do math in my head while I'm talking, and it ain't working. The math may not be math, but it's something like that. 50 plus pounds by I think August if I stick to the app. My calorie intake, my exercise, blah, blah, blah. I did get up this morning and um, I did yoga. I felt so good. I love yoga. I don't like working out. I do not like exercising. But I do love to dance. So I do that as a workout. I go to like a dance class um, and yoga. I was doing really good in January. I was on a little streak. I did my yoga every single day. Um, I lost some pounds. I started to like form a shape, but um, I was doing 
looking good. People just started telling me, like, girl, you looking, you like, you looking way, you getting smaller, blah, blah, blah. I was eating better. I was feeling better. I was doing all that, but <laughs> came February, all of it went to hell in the handbasket because I just was eating like a crazy person because I'm a stress eater. So when I stress, I just eat, 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 eat. I just be like, I don't care. I just, I want to eat everything. Ah, give me food. <laughs> So, March has been, what are we, 12 days into March now, something like that. No, we're 14 days into March, so we're two weeks in. It's March 14th. Two weeks in, it had not been bad. It's definitely been better than, um, better than January. That's for sure. So, uh, I mean, not January, better than February. And I haven't really been eating like crazy or bad. So anyway, back to the app. So I got the app. I logged in everything, blah, 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 like my profile. And I like apps that tell me, okay, you can lose this much by this date. And this app does that. Um, it also... Let's me put in intermittent fasting. Um, so it reminds me of my fasting times, when to start, when to stop fasting. So I'm doing the 16-8 fast, where I don't eat for 16 hours. I eat for eight hours. I fast for 16 hours. So I'm gonna do. I'm doing that, um, and then I can log in my food, and it gives me food reminders. So it's reminding me to eat four times a day breakfast, lunch, dinner, and then have a snack. And then I was able to log in the exact time that I wanted to eat. Which I haven't, I don't know a lot of apps that do that, which I really like. They don't let you like log in your food times. It'll do it for you based off of what they feel like your food time should be, like each time. Or like, it'll say start eating. You can log like what time you wanna start eating. Say if you wanna start eating at 10 o'clock and then it'll put everything else in there for you. At least the apps that I've used. Um, that's what they do. And this app does not do that, which I like. It lets me fully customize how I want it to be. Um, yeah, but anyway, it's called Yazio or something. Yazoo. So I'm cooking dinner. What did I eat today? Let me see. I did my yoga at like six this morning. I ate. I didn't eat the best lunch. I had some nuggets, you know, like the little nuggets that come in the freezer. Um, I ate nuggets for lunch. Breakfast. I didn't have breakfast. I had, did I have coffee? I didn't have coffee today. What did I eat today? I think that's all I ate today. And I had some junior mints. Because I love junior mints. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's what I had. I had the junior mints and the nuggets now um i gotta start eating more times a day i guess the more i do it and get used to it and remember that i'm supposed to be on this um food healthy food journey and this weight loss journey it's hard for me to remember and sometimes even when i get my notifications i shoo them away <laughs> like if i'm in the middle of doing something and it just have like stupid notifications i need to stop doing that because I'll forget, like, hey, you're supposed to be doing this, supposed to be doing that. That's what the notifications are for. So, I got to remember that. Um, But, yeah, for dinner, I got me some shrimp right here. So, I'm about to... Ooh, they stink. I'm not really supposed to think this bad. Um, I'm going to have to double check those and make sure they're good. <laughs> But I'm about to make some shrimp with uh, peppers. I got green peppers, red peppers, shrimp. I'm about to fry it all up or saute it all up and some onions. And then I'm going to steam me some broccoli. And that is going to be my dinner. All right, guys. So I decided to just do a little voiceover. Here I have onions, some green peppers and red peppers that I've cut up. I'm just going to saute those. Then pull them to the side so that um, I can cook the rest of my ingredients in the skillet. 
Next, I'm just going to put um, a little butter in the skillet so that I can get it nice and, I don't know. <laughs> but I'm going to add some garlic, then I'll add my shrimp to the, uh, to the skillet. Cooking up my shrimp and butter. I have a little bit of olive oil in there, but not a lot at all. Mostly butter. Um, next, right here, everything's cooked up. I've put the shrimp and the vegetables together, and I added some spinach on top. And here, I'm just going to put a little um, garlic paste and some different seasonings. Because, you know, I got to season my food. It can't be dry. It can't be dry. And I put my secret ingredient, my um, liquid aminos, so good. And there we have it. Here is my meal. It was amazing. When I say this is so damn good, I literally feel like I could eat this every single time. Um, I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm, I'm a chef around this baby. Around here. For real. But, um, yeah, so I'm about to finish eating my dinner. Then, I have my laptop right here because we're joined at the hip. But, Leave my dinner while I am watching this video and preparing for some stuff I need to do because I'm preparing for my launch. Um, yeah, and after that, I'm gonna take a shower and go to bed. I probably watch Fresh Prince. Is that what it's called? Bel Air. I think it's called Bel Air. The new Fresh Prince or whatever. Bel Air. And go to sleep. Wake up and do it all again tomorrow. What is happening? Oh, okay. All right, y'all. So today is a new, fresh, new day. Let me put this on this side, cause yeah, I like when it's right here. Um, it's also St. Patty's Day. I'm not wearing green, but I got green in my yeah. nails, so don't play, don't play, don't play. Oh my God, green now. Hmm. Girl, what is these shorts you went and put on? Look at this child. Look at her. I pinched her because she didn't have on green. So she goes back in the house and put on these green shorts over the top of these leggings. These green pajama shorts at that. You just like coming out the house looking crazy. Oh, 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 oh. Don't forget her shoe, her socks. Don't forget her socks. You are not wearing mixed match socks. I couldn't find her matching. What? You know we have to get out of the vehicle. Where are we going? We have to leave. Get waxed. <laughs> I have to go. I know you ain't made a face. <laughs> I Continue. To <laughs> I have to go um pay this ticket. Mm -hmm. Then I gotta pick up your granny. I gotta get an oil change. Um, that's it. Let me get some food. I want a fish sandwich. You want a fish sandwich today? No. Because you ate because it was too hot. You couldn't eat it. Well, I had enough fish for the life. For the week. Not for the life. <laughs> I said for the week. Well, I'm um, going to get me and my mama a fish sandwich. Yeah. Whatever. I'm what? You just give us a bad taste. You know, the experts in the area we're going in. Oh, yeah, it is. It's one of Charlotte. Charlotte. This car is well overdue for oil change. Um, I don't know when the last time I got one, honestly. Let's keep in mind the car set for two years. I don't know when I had the oil change. Oh, wait, this will tell me. My last oil change, so it was 2019. The last one was due October 2019. So what that tell you? What that, what that tell you? 2019 was the last time 
I got an oil change in this vehicle. just be weird and awkward because y'all know how it is when you go somewhere especially if it's in a higher price area um <laughs> you don't want to be checking prices well i'm like that like i don't know like but you know what area you in you know where you at like you know the shit not gonna be cheap don't come in here pinching pennies so i don't want to be like that but bitch bitch when my total came up to 55 motherfucking dollars for a lip wax and a shaving gel i was confused i was like uh-huh like bitch what did i get like the fuck i was like oh my god and then i have to pay do a tip like what bitch what 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 why just why tell me why anyway that was my little blooper for the damn day I said, oh honey, this shit gonna have to last a year. Cause I can't afford to but be paying that much for shaving cream, for shaving gel. Cause I used to go there and get like all my waxes. But I stopped going there to get my bikini wax because which I'm actually gonna start back. But it was so expensive. It was so expensive. And I go there because of the type of wax they use. And because the ladies there, they've all been um estheticians for like 20 plus years so they know what they're doing like i can't be letting everybody pulling and sticking and picking off my hoo high like no like i'm not that girl like no <laughs> bitch you gotta know what you're doing don't come down here playing 
So, wait, let me get my walk going. Okay, yeah, I'm about to go get me another fish sandwich because I'd be so bad. But, yeah, so that's why I like to go there. But my waxes was coming up to 100, 120, 150. I'm like, what did I, what did I get? What did I get? What did I get? What is happening? And every time I look up, shit, that's why I don't know where I'm going. I don't pass where I'm going. Every time I look up, they keep increasing their prices. Oh, I'm just gone. Oh, shit. No, I'm not. Just leave me the fuck alone. Shut up. And, bitch, don't be blowing at me, ho. Um. I probably need to get off the vlogging, because... That's how I passed it. Baby cake. Let me show y'all. This is called therapy system. This is the $28 plus tax bottle of shaving gel that I decided to go buy today. Mm -hmm. That's it. I mean, I guess it'll last me a long time. If I, depending, if I'm deciding to like do bikini waxes and stuff, it'll last me like a year. But if I'm not gonna do bikini waxes and I'm gonna be shaving, it's not going to last me day long. It'll last a few months. So, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Trying to make the right turn. I swear I act like I don't know what the hell I'm at. Well, I don't know this area. Like I didn't grow up right here and live here for all these years. Come on, hunty. Come on, hunty. Come on, come on, come on. Which really I feel like I don't because every time I come back over here, I mean I don't live in the area anymore, but every time I come back over here, y'all they putting up new shit. It's new buildings, new restaurants, new new this, new that, new houses, new apartments. I'm like, where 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 am I? I don't know where I'm at. And I literally grew up, when I say across the street, I really mean directly across the street from where I'm at right now is where I grew up, where I lived for the first, like, 14 years of my life. So, I should know the area. However, I'd be confused because nothing looks the same. <sighs> okay. Anywho, I'm back. I'm about to go in here and give me a good old fish sandwich yes i'm getting another fish sandwich yes i know i had ate a fish sandwich in my vlog my last vlog previous vlog if you've seen it then you probably already know that yes i'm going to get another one because it was so freaking amazing so let me show y'all i'm gonna show y'all see this is the place boatons where i get my fish can y'all see it the screen is kind of Shining bright. Let me, let me just remove this little paper. I see my fish now. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm about to dig all up in this. Oh. My little setup here failed. Yeah, I'm about to. Oh, so good. I'm about to sit here and eat my fish. I want to talk to y'all while I eat. But being real, at the moment, I really don't have nothing to talk about. I mean, I'm sure I could talk about something, but I don't feel like it. I just want to eat my food. I was looking up minivans right because i was thinking about buying a minivan to put on Turo. also to use for the summer because i want a van for like road trips and stuff i do not know minivans cost so much damn money like why are they so expensive like for real Minivan are high as fuck. 
So, this is why I wasn't going to talk and eat. <laughs> but, yeah, I was looking up like a, a Chrysler, what's it called, Pacifica. I had a used one on them, a 2021 used one. For fifty one thousand dollars, like what? I'm confused. People paying fifty thousand dollars for minivans? Why? Who and why? I was like, okay, that'd be cute. Give me a little minivan. I was thinking I could pay like fifteen, twenty. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. Not for the nice ones. The nice ones, the cheapest I saw was like 33. And it still had almost 100,000 miles. It was like 86,000 miles on them for $33,000. Minivans are high. Did y'all know that? <laughs> I was like, what? And that wasn't the Pacifica. That was a, a Honda, whatever the Honda was, Odyssey. It was nice though, but mm -mm. No, absolutely not. It's a no for me. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> I mean, I'm not giving up on my journey. I'm going to keep looking. Because I do want to get a minivan. I want to get a minivan. By the summer. You know, people take summer trips and stuff. Or people come and visit, especially Nashville, in groups. So people be wanting a minivan. I want to provide that for them. But not for $50,000, I don't. Fuck that. $50,000? $50,000. Like what? But y'all, when I get a minivan, people gonna wear me out. Because my daddy, my daddy has always had minivans, y'all. Always, like all my life. I mean, he don't have a minivan now. Because he don't drive no more. But... He's always had minivans. Anybody knows my daddy, he's famous for having a damn van. Y'all know, know the old school vans? They used to come with the, like, kitchen. It was like a damn house van. It used to come with, like, the chairs. Did the chairs spin around? I can't remember that part. I think they did. But, and they used to have TVs, cabinets. <coughs> I don't think they had sinks. I don't remember. But I do remember they had cabinets. All that, cause my daddy always had one, and y'all, his vans would he would fall, he would drive them damn vans. He would drive. Sorry, <sighs> the hot sauce gives me indigestion. He would drive them damn vans till the wheels came off. Literally, literally, literally. I'm not even joking. Like for real, that man would tape up his van in a heartbeat. He think duct tape solve everything. I.e., clearly, I'm just like him. As my window back here is duct tape the fuck up. <laughs> but that man would duct tape. <clears throat> That man would duct tape everything, y'all. So, he would duct tape his headlights on his minivan. I don't know why he had to put duct tape on them. I guess the headlights was falling out. I don't know. But they would have duct tape. The bumper one time was, um, I think he hit something. And the bumper was fought with it, like, fell down. That man duct tape, uh, duct tape that damn bumper back up there on that damn car. He sure did. <laughs> that man would duct tape anything. It would be rolling. And you can't tell him he won't fight. Well, his van won five, baby. He ain't coming by none of that. <laughs> right. Mm-mm. He loves his van. So, and now all of a sudden, I want a minivan. Which is weird, but I guess I'm a product of my environment. No, I just see dollar signs, like, just being real. <laughs> but they are nice, though, because we rented one one time. We were in the minivan, me and Janelle did, to go to Ikea in Atlanta. We rented a minivan. They gave us a um, Pacifica. Now, that van was so damn nice. It was so nice. We was like, oh, my God. She was like, I want one of these. And I was like, we are not getting a no fucking van. Like, at the time, I was like, girl, bye. Giving her the side eye. Like, girl, you would never catch me in a minivan. But the van was super nice. It had the leather seats. The doors open on both sides. Um, it was just nice. I think it had a roof. Did it have, what you call them, a sunroof or whatever? The led all the way back? I think it did. Y'all, that van was nice. <laughs> so, 
so they are nice and i would definitely yeah but not fifty thousand dollars nice hell no hell no fuck that really i just wanted to pay 15. i don't know why they remind me i used to give 15 for a beat call me do you want i'm the same og hey as you can see, I got my hookah. I got my whole little setup right here. I'd show it to y'all, but I really don't play moving the camera, honestly. Um, but yeah, so I do have on a shirt. It doesn't look like it, but I do. Well, it's not a shirt. It's like this little, I don't know what it is. It's like this little towel cover-up thing, whatever. This little thing I got, but... She's trying to get my lighting together for me, y'all. Anyway, y'all, so it's Saturday. I'm just now coming on here for the day. It should be like, put it up here. Come on, come on. Oh, shit. This is a lot. You look good? Okay, she got me. Okay, so, bye. Thank you. I love you. No lighting, guys. We couldn't get it to work. Um... Anyway, what was I saying? So, it's Saturday. I'm just now coming on here, y'all. I have been doing nothing all day. I've been chilling, really, most of the day. I woke up super late. I didn't get up to, like, 1130. That's when I got, like, out of the bed this morning. Then, what I do? Oh, I just chill. I laid around the house. I watch TV. For some reason, I wanted to watch, like, I just been in the mood to watch a really cute, like, rom-com. So, I wanted to watch, like, one of my favorite movies, which is just what I did earlier. I watched um, Foods Rush In. And I love that movie. I've seen it like a gazillion times, but I could literally watch it a gazillion more. <laughs> um, so that's what I did. That's not really all I did. And then I fixed my hookah. I've now I'm about to get ready tonight. We're having a date night, and I have brought all my things to the kitchen table because I did not feel like going upstairs to my um like my makeup table and stuff. I didn't feel like doing all that. <clears throat> Plus, for whatever reason, half my stuff was down here. So I was just like, whatever. I'm going to just get ready downstairs. That's what I'm doing. Um, so, yeah, I guess I figured I figured we'd have a little chit-chat. A little get ready with me. Chit-chat. This is, um, whew. The smell is strong. I'm very sensitive to scents. But this is, who is this? CoverGirl Priming Glow Mist. Like a rose water spray. I feel like it's just a little refreshing little look. I like it. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Or whatever. Add me some goodies from Sephora. Because I've spilled. Hold on. Oh. Alright. So I got, um, I just got like this little mini eyebrow. I don't even know what it's called. But it's like a little, you fill in your eyebrows with it. And then my favorite eyebrow pencil. That's all I got, really. That's all I got. They gave me a sample, which I guess I'll wear this tonight. I'm going to try this. Like I said, I'm very sensitive to smells. It's not even in here. Oh, it's in the box. I'm very sensitive to smells, but I did smell th oh, this. This right here smells so good. I did smell this. Actually, I sprayed it on me once before just to see if I could tolerate it and wear it. <laughs> which I could so I probably will go get the actual bottle. It's the um, St. Laurent Libre, I guess. It smells good, y'all. Smells good. Really but that's it. I'm just about to um I'm about to get ready for our little date night. I'm excited. Y'all, we haven't had a date night in a long time. Like it's March. We haven't had a date night since like September. Um, not September, October. Like right when we got back from Dubai. What did we go? Oh, we went to the Mary J. Blige concert. That was the last time we had a date night. We did have a date two, like two weeks ago. That was like our first, first date of the year. It's, it's been a while. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was our first date of the year or whatever, which that was a day day, but we had fun, went to brunch at this hookah bar and that was cool but tonight we are going out out um 
I can't do my brows on camera. And I'm also in a rush because technically we need to leave our house in like 30 minutes. But that ain't gonna happen because I still gotta curl my hair. We're gonna be late. But um <laughs> we uh Yeah, we're going out. We're going to a restaurant called Urban Grub. It's one of my favorite restaurants. It's so freaking good. Um so yeah, we're gonna go there. Um We're gonna go to Urban Grub and eat. I'm so excited because, like I said, that's one of my favorite restaurants. And I love oysters, and they oysters are so, 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 so good. So I'm excited. Um, I'm excited to go eat. To go eat there. Eat and get some drinks. And then afterwards, we'll go. We said we was going to go to this other spot. How Bourbon Street, it's like this little blues bar, bar where they do like live music and play like blues and just like different little live music, but it's fun, y'all. I love that place. Um, I do that thing. So we'll probably go there afterwards, maybe. But we ran online. It was like you had to have a reservation, but then they didn't have any reservations. You can't make same day reservations after two or something. I'm like, what? What's happening? But, I mean, hopefully, I mean, they do take walk-ins, so hopefully, by the time we get there, it won't be packed and we can just go on in there. But it's not anything going on in Nashville this weekend, so hopefully, it won't be too bad. Hopefully, it ain't a bunch of damn people out or out-of-towners. Plus, it's supposed to be cold, so hopefully, people in the house. I gotta fix that little spike. Yeah, hopefully people are in the house. Because it is cold outside. Got it in my hookah. While I do my makeup. I act like I just got all the time in the world, and I don't. <laughs> because we still got to... Um, we still got to drop a little Miss Muffet off to my mama's before we even go. But my mama don't live far from the restaurant, just like 10 minutes away. So that's good. Y'all, it is not enough light. I don't know what's going on with these lights. It just looks very dark. Oh, let me turn on this. <laughs> that didn't really do much. Did it? Maybe a little bit. I do feel like it's a little bit brighter. Um... This is empty. I need to get some more. I really like this concealer. But, I don't know. Lately, I've just been like, feeling like, I need to find um a different concealer, like a better one. I saw on Sephora that they had this Tarte. Tarte has this concealer. It's Tarte Hydro. Something, something. I don't know. It says something, something vegan. I don't know. I don't want it because it's vegan or nothing. I just want, um, that's my favorite brush. I don't know what my favorite brush is that I like to blend with, so whatever. But, um, yeah, they have this, like, vegan friendly. But I just like the, the colors. I feel like the colors are different. And I feel like they may be a good match for the type of concealers that I like to wear. Um, yeah. So. I hope y'all can't hear that music in the background. Janelle is in there getting ready playing her House of Fire. Or whatever it's called. Whatever music she playing. Um. I can hear it, but I don't know. I ain't trying to get no copyright, so whatever. Speaking of, I'm about to turn on my music. So I just want to come on here and chit chat for a little second. I really ain't talking about nothing, but I am about to get ready. 
And I, I don't have enough time to chat with y'all and get ready. And I also got my costume right here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Casamigos and Fresca. The grapefruit Fresca. It's so good, y'all. You gotta try it. If you haven't tried it yet, what you waiting for? Or whatever. Because it's good. It's really good. I've turned a few people on to it. <laughs> um, yeah, it's really good. I'm just going to put on this uh, eyeshadow primer. This P. Louise. What's her name? I don't know. I think it is called P. Louise. Um, do people still use this? I don't know. I use it because, shit, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. You know what I'm saying? Yummy, yummy. Because I like it. I have no idea how I'm about to do my makeup, which is not good because every time I start doing makeup and I don't really have a a destination where I'm trying to end up to, I just end up doing a whole bunch of crazy looking shit and then it be taking me forever because I don't be thinking about it and then I don't like it and I got to go back and try to fix it and so I'm want to go out here looking like a damn clown. So... Oh no. I don't even know what I'm wearing really. I think I may know. I got this shirt that I bought from Shein literally last year, like 2021. And I never wore the shirt, y'all. I'll use my Morphe palette. But yeah, I never wore the shirt. So maybe um maybe I can wear that. If I can fit the damn thing. Because the Lord knows I don't gain weight since 2021. So. I don't know. But let me slap this on real quick. And let me get a little ratchet. I got to put on some, some music. Because that helps me move faster. Finally ready. This is my outfit. Change then, baby. Huh? Say change. Huh? So I just got on this little top. This little. Oh, I was scared. I didn't think I was gonna be able to fit it, but I can fit it. It's cute too. It's this little turtleneck. It's two separate pieces. Like this goes over the top. I got this from Shein, of course. Now let's get on some little jeans. And just some black boots. Simple but cute and sexy. I curled my hair to the best of my ability. So yeah. All right, y'all. It's about the time, bad past time for us to go. I need some edge control, but I don't know where it's at. Oh, it's hot. I'm hot. I burnt myself curling my hair. It's just a whole thing, but. It's all good. What is that? My bra strap showing. <sighs> all right. I guess I'm gonna make me a to-go drink because she's changing her shoes. Cause she does. That's what she does. She sits there for two hours while I get ready, and then when I'm finally ready, she gotta pee and she gotta change something. It never fails. Never, ever, ever does it fail. I'm hot. I'm so hot. I'm trying to get me a cup so I can fix me a drink. I'm a girl. I need some hairspray. It's looking dull at the top, which I hate. I like shiny hair. I don't like when my hair looks dry. <laughs> oh, but I did what I did what I could do. Did what I could do in the time that I had. Cause of course we're late. As always, I'm about to make me some casa with some fresca it's gonna be good i have to call and push our reservation back because it's for 8 45 and it's 8 40 we ain't gonna make it we ain't gonna make it to the new time either yeah they're gonna be closed by the time we get them don't you say my name say my name
Anyway, good morning. What is up, guys? I'm tired, y'all. I look tired. I just feel bad. <laughs> anyway, so we went out last night. We had a great time. It was a cute, super fun little um, date night. We went out to eat, and then afterwards, we went um, downtown Nashville to this place called Bourbon Street where it's like it's like a blues house or whatever they have like live performances it was so much fun we had so much fun up until this couple came up talking our heads off they were drunk as fuck talking 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 all in our face to the point we was like okay we finna leave like let's go because they would not leave us alone it was a hot mess like I can't stand like I'm not like really a people person anyway i don't just like go up and just be talking to strangers but i cannot stand when people come up talking to me and they're drunk and it's just non-stop and they be falling all over the place like all in, like i cannot stand it like the lady literally almost fell i had to catch her i'm just like oh my god like let's go and i was mad because i wanted some wings and we couldn't even get no wings because they wouldn't leave us alone so i was like i don't even want to wait on wings to get ready like let's just leave <sighs> so that was the extent of our night but look y'all look i burnt i was curling my hair and i burnt it i always burn myself either on my head or somewhere on my hands every time i use my wand curlers every time like it never fails <laughs> and them things get hot as fuck but yeah right now i'm about to go um baby can you break <coughs> I thought you was gonna. I thought you would have got my jacket. Huh? Can you get my jacket? I know I'm about to go get some food, something to eat. It's late. What time is it? Like one o'clock? I don't know. We just got up not too long ago. Um. But yeah, we're about to go get some um something to eat. We're about to go get some really amazing burgers at Jimmy Bean's. Right. She knows I was going to say the name wrong. What, what is it? Jimmy Bean. I want to say it right. Jack Brown. Jack Brown's. Jack Brown's. We're about to go to Jack Brown's. <laughs> I always get the name wrong. I don't know. I call it Jimmy Bean's. But anyway, we're about to go to Jack Brown's and get some good ass burgers. And if y'all have one in y'all area, you should try it for real. And I'm going to get two fried Oreos. Mm -hmm. It's going to be so good. I'm excited. Thank you, babe. Cold as fuck outside. Like, why is it 30 degrees in March? The world literally may never know. Like, for real. I swear. I think they play with the weather. Oh. <sighs> it's cold. I don't like when I vlog because I turn off the music. What you doing, baby? Turning on my phone. Oh, did you know music had a new album came out today? No. Is this what this is? Uh huh. <laughs> so I gotta get off the phone so we can listen to it. It's called, what's it called? Villains, Victims and Villains. 
this one. I was like, what is this? This is fun. And I knew it had to be my boy. You only heard a split second of it. Did you have fun last night, guys? I mean, I kicked it like I was 19. <laughs> Yeah, we felt like we were so young. We, we can't even have assaulted. The woman kept putting her vagina on my neck. <laughs> That's the couple I was just talking about. They was doing the absolute most. I usually make friends in bars, but when I'm not in the mood to do it and just want to chill and enjoy my day, I ain't just all the rude to do. Right. I like to speak to you and all of that, but outside of that, you can chat for a little bit, but I don't want stand in front of me and spit in my face <laughs> and just be talking and just be talking that's exactly what she, she spit in my face i know six times <laughs> and the man kept talking about how i guess he wants to be gay but he can't be gay it was a whole thing Cause he's in the military. yeah because he's in the military and he's not allowed to live his life the way he wants to <laughs> yeah that's what he was telling me he was like, you guys have a privilege that I'd never be able to experience. I was like, what are you talking about? Freedom. He was like, I'm in the military. And I'm like, okay, what does that mean? And he said that he would never be able to live the life. He was like, she's aware. She she trusts me for the depth of the way I am. I'm like, okay, sir. Yeah, so she apparently lets him go off and do his thing and She just chills. And I kept asking, am I us coming to smoke with them? And I was like, uh, no. No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what y'all got going on. Right. They was, I've never met people like that. It's giving me three <laughs> sex traffickers. Right. They was weird. They were so weird. He kept saying, we're the dudes of the group. I'm like, what, sir? <laughs> Like, first of all, number one, she's not a dude. And number two, bitch, we is not a group. We don't even want to talk to y'all. <laughs> this is not a group. <laughs> buy one of these you get a free pack. Ooh. What if you break it, what happens? <laughs> I like I this bottle because you just like black. that red and black. It don't even smell good. Yes it does. Girl, no it doesn't. <laughs> it smells like aftershave. How much is this one? We get this little cute teddy bear too. Yeah. How often do you think they switch out these coffee beans? This looks good too. I like that bottle. This smells good. You like it? Mm hmm. That one smells really good, don't it? Mm hmm. That smells good. That smells like how he's dressed. That's how that smells. Like, I'm fly, got on my tux. Let's do that one. I'm shocked that that one was cheaper. I don't know, it's gonna be more. What you gonna do? She got all the coins. See, she only spends on herself. See how she is? Oh, wow. <laughs> What's here? Oh, yeah. Oh, 
Is that the black and red one? Is that the one? Oh man. Okay, that's the one I got. <laughs> Maybe was the picture navy? Oh man. Oh, they got some heaters in there for you. Going through the car wash. Oh, okay. one of my favorite things to do. Right, stay warm. Thank you. Bye. You too. I love going through the car wash, y'all. Especially when they have like, oh, this one ain't dark though, with all the lights. I like the ones that be dark and have all the lights. This one got windows. Baby, say $10 your first month. Oh, $10 is off your first month. He's sweet. I'm surprised you said you, this one wash your car good because this is the car wash I had to run my car through twice. No, they've changed. I think they changed. This is a whole other different company now. Oh, it's different? Oh, yeah. shit. Okay. And this is the one I was telling you that um, they give you the free towels to wipe your car off with. Oh. Window, window cleaner, everything. They fancy. Fancy smell. Hey, why you didn't tell me to charge my phone last night? It's about to die. Ooh, here we go. I'm like a kid. That's my bitch. <laughs> um, I am. I'm about to do some work. It's Sunday. I use my Sundays to get my hair. Whatever. I use my Sundays to um prepare for my week. So I gotta prepare a bunch of like I got a lot of stuff to do. I gotta prepare. My weekly test. Do I get hair on my thing? I don't see it. I got to prepare my weekly test for my assistant. Because if I don't be on top of it, she texts me all day, every day. What to do, what to do, what to do. And I don't want that. Because it drives me bonkers. But it be my fault. Because I don't be organized like I should be. Um, so I got to get some tests and stuff ready for her for the week um i gotta get some content planned for the week i gotta find a new video editor because i finally got some videos for my other my main youtube channel but i think my editor has flown the coop she was supposed to edit my last video i never heard anything back from her she said she said she was working on editing it that was a week ago. It's been three weeks now. I'm like, girl, okay, I'm just, I'm about to cancel your contract and see if I can find somebody else. But what I did, like, she was, she was, she was, she was good. She was okay. But she was cheap. <laughs> I guess you get what you pay for, right? I got to get prepared for, I'm going to host my very first live. Yes, baby. I want to smoke a hookah, but I'm naked. You are not naked. I got to take this off. Huh? You sit down and smoke. You don't want to smoke with that on? I'm hot. Okay, baby, you're not even in the video. Sit right here where you always sit. The video's not right there. I'm sit right here in your chair. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I'm getting prepared to do my very first live webinar. So I'm a little nervous about that. So I'm a lot nervous. When is your webinar? Well, shit now. Good question. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, let me see. I'm 
I think I had booked the appointment. You booked the appointment for five o'clock. It's five thirty-five. And you're late. You never showed up. You're late. We about to do it right now. Baby, pass me the hook. Pass me the hook. Baby, pass me the hook. two on the list for like best um business bank accounts so i was like i'm gonna try it out i think number one was i forget who number one i think it was blue vine was number one i don't remember i just remember this is number two and i don't know why i didn't want to use blue vine but i didn't um so yeah we'll see how it goes i need to activate my card though i put money on it but uh, I hate activating cards. I had to replace all my cards. I ain't activated none of my cards yet. I activated the Who's cash app card because it was easy. Who said that? I hate activating cards. I do. I you just saying, but you get on the phone and argue with people, <laughs> but you don't like to activate your phone. <laughs> I don't. I don't know why. It irritates my soul. I don't know what it is. You just don't. You're not a fan of technology. I'm not. I'd be like, what the fuck? I push the button. And what was the problem here? Like, it'd be a whole thing. It'd literally be a whole thing. That cash up card was the easiest card because it came with a little scanner. And I just scanned it. Boom. My card was activated. I was like, they should all fucking be like this. Can they all not be like that? Well, you didn't even read the scene. That one looks pretty Stresses me too. out. Oh, <laughs> it got a scan thing too. Oh, I can activate this one. Mm. Oh, I need to do that. It's got a scan thing too. We are in 2023, so nobody no, should No, because I had to reactivate my Navy Federal card, my credit card, and it was like, go to this, NavyFederal.org, blah, blah, blah. And Not I'm true. like, that's what the thing said? I Not still true. got it. I don't like it. Tell, ask me to come back with You don't like the hookah? What's wrong with it? It's choking. <coughs> you messed it up. I don't know what she came and done. Don't be a hater. I remade my hookah. It's real good now. Come and smoke it because you always wait until it starts burning up. And then you make me. I don't like when you yell at me. It's so strong. No. It's strong. Yeah. Got my mom read my roses I did appreciate my roses. It need a little simple syrup. I did appreciate my roses. I love my roses. She let my roses die. Because mm, it's my job to keep them clean. I mean, alive. Uh -oh. You know, I don't know how to do it. I forgot I got 
got all those new I got all those new cups under there. You hear them from me. Girl, I didn't put that in there. Just put a, cup a little bit of simple salt. I am a cup holder. Cup and notebooks. My favorite. Yes, I know my straw is upside down. It does not work when I turn it the right way. Don't know why. But when I use it this way, it works perfectly. Good. Okay, girl, I guess the hookah must be good because now you hog it. I just got it. Yeah. You know, like when you say stuff like that. I ain't nothing like that, lady. Girl, you are your mother's child. I'm not talking to you for the rest of the day. Do that. Like <coughs> That's what you get. Okay, since I got you in here, anyways, I figured this would be a good time to talk about our plans for 2023 and how we're going to have. I don't ruin my mood. My plan is to spend every dollar we, we, we earn. That is not true. And you say you was going to do better and you're not. I am doing better. We ain't been nowhere. I ain't planned to go nowhere. I ain't said nothing about going nowhere. None of that. You it's ain't been about said it out loud months. and you kept your little books away. But I know you got. I got what? I know you got a little notebook somewhere, Scott. You probably don't. You, I think you don't hear them from me. That was from last year. 2023. That was, did it say 2023? No, yes, it didn't. Yes, it did. I just, I wish you hadn't taken the trash out. I know it didn't. I wrote that last year for well, last year. I took the summer. trash out because I kept getting bullied about taking the trash out. No. <laughs> Absolutely not. I love you. Mm-mm. I can't live without you, baby. And I don't believe it. As much as you tell me how much I get on your nerves, I guess my self esteem is low. Ugh, just make it stop. What's the day of today? March 19, 2023. Janelle is full of shit. Shout out to who? To the hookah maker. Woo woo! I sure wish I could enjoy some of the hookah. This hookah is vital. It's a bomb. All right, honey buns, that's it for this week. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next week.